Excuse me, sir. How may I help you? It's my wife. She... she... I'm sorry. It's just that... Her funeral. I love her so much. I understand. Of course, of course, Mr. Stark. This is a sealed casket. It'll protect your loved ones for years from undesirables. I don't know. Metal? Metal can be a bit, um, impersonal. This is solid mahogany wood, incredibly durable. This is the one. Well, this does come with a white lace and silk lining, but that adds about another $500 to huh. Silk is perfect. Lilies. Rebecca loves lilies. These aren't real. These are for display purposes only. We do use freshly cut flowers for both the wake and funeral service. For a moment I could almost smell them, but I was just remembering what my wife's hair smells like. Isn't that silly? No. No, it's not. I brought Rebecca a bouquet of lilies on our second date. You know, sometimes smell can be a more powerful reminder than anything else. <laughs> lilies it is. If you don't mind, there is one more thing. What is it? Could I, could I see the, the last place Rebecca will be taken care of? I'm not quite sure I know what you're asking. I, I would like to see the room where Rebecca will be prepared. Well, normally we don't allow. I suppose we could make an exception. I thought it would look more like an operating room. Well, this is a standard facility. The idea that my wife will be spilling out. Will Rebecca still look like herself? Rebecca will be taken care of, Mr. Stark. Thank you. If I could just get the name of the doctor that we need to call to release the body. I don't know. That, that's no problem, Mr. Stark. Just give us a call at your earliest convenience. I will. I'm deeply sorry for your loss, Mr. Stark. I can see that you've loved your wife a great deal. Yes, I love her very much. 